Now, businesswoman Anjo Roge has opened up on high-profile government officials she interacted with when the 17 billion Kenya shillings oil consignment was held at the port. During an interview on Sunday, Jerry, who is embroiled in the multi-billion scandal, explained that she had been in the business for over 30 years. According to her narration, Jerry met with officials from the Kenya Port Authority, KPA, or KEPA, who inquired whether she had a license to import the oil. It was at this point she was directed to meet the Energy Cabinet Secretary, Davis Churcher. When she allegedly met with Churcher, she was informed that the fuel belonged to someone else. While at Churcher's office, Jerry claimed that she met with Capsa Bet Member of Parliament, Oscar Sudi. Jerry also revealed that while she was abducted, she received death threats for claiming ownership of the 100,000 metric tons of fuel. The businesswoman spoke while in a hiding as she awaits to appear before the National Assembly to shed more light on the matter. She said this in a quote, I don't know what a person with money looks like. It is only God who can lift you up, end of quote. Meanwhile, her lawyer, Cliff Ombeta, emphasized that she will not present herself to the DCI or the Directorate of Criminal Investigations before going to Parliament. This is some Cuba news.